Right. O B E R L O A D I. So it can't be that. O B E R L O A D I N. Oh, it could be this one. Nope, not holographic. So now I'm just going to use that one as the base one because I know that it can't have any in common. So H O L O G R A P H I C. H O L O G R A P H I C. Oh, wait, wait, why did I not try this one? I'm being stupid. Let's check it with overloading. O V E R L O A D I N. Oh, look at. <laughs> oh, wow. I am not uh, right in the head right now, apparently. Okay, first of all, I'll check. It's guarding electrical switch room. Oh, I know what, what that is. So first we'll unlock that. And we'll look at these. Complaint. Mrs. Purvis, drunk and disorderly. Great. Uh, <clears throat> uh, da, 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 guard on call. Wait, Syria Madras security log, 11 2 p.m. Guard on call. Morris Taylor, or Tyler, rather. Uh, describe the incident. Uh, 10 p.m. Received complaints about noise in upper bar. Then emergency call from the main floor cashier, uh, Cage, who reported, quote, Old bat on ceiling. <laughs> Investigating. Found guests cheering Mrs. Millicent Purvis, 72, who had climbed over the upper bar railing and was walking on the support beams, indicating loudly that she was, quote, going to join the circus. She had already tripped over one hollow emitter, unhurt, and was, uh, Inviting guests out on the beam so he could use them like monkey bars. Uh, he forgot to say quote on that one. Anyway, climbed after her, uh, cornered her near the rafter over the cashier's area, then brought Mrs. Purvis to holding and called her daughter to come escort her to her room. No damage done to rafters or the emitter. Mrs. Purvis's daughter was uh, visibly agitated by the incident and too embarrassed to take any legal action, saying that she, quote, didn't want to cause any more trouble for Mr. Sinclair. Need to gate off the rafter to prevent repeat incidents. About log two. Complaints lost and found. Uh, Sierra Madre security log, 8 7 a.m. Guard on call, Morris Tyler. Described the incident. Mrs. Purvis' daughter called down to ask if we happened to find her mother's purse, which she uh, may have dropped during last night's stroll. Uh, we found the purse on the main floor. None of the valuables were inside. May have been taken when the purse dropped, or Mrs. Purvis may have emptied the purse contents during last night's incident. Hmm. I'm gonna wait to. Ooh, nice. Oh yes. I cannot run, but I can fix things by using other things. And now, that's awesome. I'm not sure where the cashier's whatever is. Oh, why did I do that? I didn't even save or anything. That was dangerous. I'm too used to playing Oblivion with that skeleton key. I didn't want that hat. Hmm. Vodka. I really, really am glad that I can just m make all these alcoholic beverages now. It's really going to be useful in playing the game. Green plate. More computers and stuff. Clipboards and Andre. Some I play? No. Security Chief Assistance Desk. I love how they named this desk, but there's nothing in it. What's the point? Security measure meeting. Uh, since you missed it, Sinclair outlined security measures today. I wasn't blind to what was happening in the news. Wanted to take steps if the Chinese got a foothold on uh, American soil. 
ran us through the added uh, functionality of the holograms and explained the construction of the casino, its emergency protocols, and the broadcasting that we're using for the gala event. Or gala, as they say. Well, that's just gay. La. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah, no. Guys and nut jobs still. Uh, see, er, guys and nut jobs still seems to have the bases covered. I guess the isolation of the casino was intentional. Not sure what he's hoping to protect. Sure seems obsessed with it. Yes, he seems obsessed with a lot of things. The unnamed desk, however, has something in it. God, so he's still oblivion controls. Ooh. It's reinforced though, so I better use it. See, now it does five because I repaired it. That's good. There you are. I think this is the, uh... That might have hurt me, actually. But anyway, I think that's the, uh... Oh, caution. Yeah, that one. So first I'm going to see... Where's the cashier's counter? No, I'm not sure, but I have to set it anyway, so I might as well just do it. See so security passcode? What's that? I don't think I've ever found that before. Uh, data. Miscellaneous. The passcode for the cashier room security hol hologram is Mr. Fizzle 17. Please don't forget it. Again, I could lose my job. They found out I gave it to you. Uh, see you in the electrical class after the gala event. God damn it, now I'm saying gala. I'm going to hold by my pronunciation of gala. Anyway, I wonder what Mr. Fizzle 17 is. Is that like a reference to... Uh, somebody that plays the game or what? I don't know. Oh, hello. Oh, look at that. I should drink that water. Nice. Can I gamble? Maybe something can help you now. Security shut down. After you're done looking about, head to the lobby and we'll deal with your friends. Oh, look at that. I'm glad. I want money. What? Let's do that. I want to play roulette, sir. Look at this. I can play roulette. All right, let's play it on. Uh, let's do 23. 23 sounds good. Ah, oh, would you look at that? I lost some money. Too bad. Can't use anything. So I don't have. Or I can return things, whatever that means. But I 
could have played blackjack. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. That's a door that you can't even go through. It's working. Right Another door you can't go. Oh god. Oh man, is it gonna be right? I think it's gonna end up being are the uh Oh good. Not right now. But later. Casino's woken up, paying attention to us. Good. Wondering what happened to your team? Looks like they got moved to other floors. Interesting. Maybe that's why. Perhaps the casino recognizes specific guests, or guests with a voice or a look close enough for them to be assigned to that floor. We'll see. And hope that the power restored the systems would fully awaken. Especially the sound archives. But no. Your teammates' calls on each floor are interfering with the systems. It's the white noise filters embedded in their construction. They're blocking the casino speakers, the music. We'll need to recalibrate and score each call. To do that, you need to get close. They set the signal. I'll leave the choice up to you. My preference. And now. They're of no use. After all, it's safe to kill them now, provided you make it quick. You see, the callers don't work inside the same way. Well, it's only flaws. Else, I'd set off the callers. Be done with it. So find them and deal with them as long as you're fast and can get off the floor after killing them. that noise? Freaking me out. What is that noise? Can I do the music thing now? Or is that. Nope. Okay. Let's go this way. So good at this. I might just take the easy way out with I might end up just killing some of these guys, but we'll see. Might not, not actually be the easy way out now that I think about it, but we'll find out. <laughs> Sugar bombs are now just now worn out. That's hilarious. I ate those when I was. Uh, still running away from those uh, ghost people. Was in the, I mean, that was in the whole last recording session. Oh, what? I just, like, shut myself in there. Tired of you, tired of place. 